Australian spoken now. The whole, whole. Uh, you gotta, you gotta excuse me. You might have to edit my, okay. my swearing and shit. That's, gotta, that's fine. You know, Australian spoken man, Uncle. Ed, you know, it's, all the fucking states that says no. The Australian people said no to us being recognised in the constitution. They said no. So where the fuck are we gonna stand? What are we gonna do? It, it's, it, it, it's, it's a, a mm. you know. Obviously, we might, you know. We, 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 we're the one that been battling, mm. you know, all through these years, and now we've come up with the, uh, we've come with the votes. Yes, they just knocked it on the head and said, "No, bug you. Mm. We're going. We're going the way we're we going to go." They say it's going to be for land grab. We don't want your fucking land. Mm. We've already got our own land. It's our land anyway. We know it. But you know, it's not. It's, it's, it's not about that stuff. It's about improving our fucking lives of our own people. Mm. You know, and um, I got a question the other day. Why are you voting yes? You live an all right life. You know, I, I'm not doing it for me, but I'm doing it for my my kin. You know, I'm doing it for my family. For my, I see my people there doing, living the, not the old mature age that they're supposed to as for non indigenous people. Mm. You know, our, our life is 50, 50, 55 years old, 50, 60 years old. Mm. You know? We, we, we reset of living the second citizens of this community of Australia. Sick of living the second community, second second uh, second citizens. Second class citizens. Second class citizens, yeah. Yep. Can you describe the disadvantage, like describe that second class citizen? Well, second class citizen to me, we are the back people. We are the black and the back people. Mm. You know, that's what really it's but all about. Yeah. It's advantages of it's it's yeah, health, housing. Mm. The same old thing. You know, there are you know things going around around my community now of of boycotting this fucking reenactment down here. What's the reenactment? The reenactment of Cook's Landing. Cook's Landing. And oh. you know we 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 as the as the people of this area we participate in that. Mm. You know, and, and for the for the you know the Australian public saying that oh well we don't recognise you anymore, so fuck this then. You know, mm. we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna boycott this shit. Mm. You know, we're not gonna be doing it no more. Mm. You know, and and uh, we must. I, I think now we must retake back our culture now. Mm. Retake it back. Fuck the fucking welcome to the country. You mm. come to my country. Fuck. They want to say the no division cause division. The yes. Yes, campaign called division. Well, mate, the no did right now. The no did the division right now. Mm. Simple as that. Mm. So. Sorry, a lot of people are saying now um, that it shows. How about you talk about yes? Too. It shows Australian racism. What do you, What do you think about that? Well, according to the stats, mate, Australia, I now call it. My friends now call it a colony. Welcome to the colony. Mm. It's still a colony. You know, it's. It's a, it's, a, it's a racist country, mm. you know, they, they say they're not racist, but, you know, every fucking no voter voted no, racist voted no, that's according to me. Yeah, yeah. yeah. They don't want to see our people excel, they don't want to see our people live longer, they still want to keep us down in the fucking, in the fucking shit bucket, keeping us down there mm. all the fucking time. Yeah, okay, and, it's gonna happen will, that way. We will never see this, see this opportunity ever no. again. Not in my lifetime, anyway. Mm. Probably not in my lifetime either. Yeah. Um. So, people who were uh, who voted no for the voice, um, said that it just it, it puts race into the constitution. The race is already in the constitution. It's already there. Mm. The race is already in the constitution. It's there. Yeah. What's the point? It's there all the time. Yep. And, and what about the um, the argument that it's another layer of bureaucracy that that, that, that wouldn't be helpful? It's another layer of bureaucracy. You know, government gave us money by the millions, and they those funding guidelines dictate how we deliver our service to our people. We cannot go and say, we can't spend that money the way we think 
we know we're going to help our people. Mm. We can't spend it that way. The government grants, the funding dictates how we fucking spend it. Mm. That's how we get audited. We might, if we, you know, we spend the money and we do it according to what the government wants us to do. We can't actually step out of the box. Mm. And we, could, we know. We know our issues. Let us be the own authors of our own fucking destiny. Mm. You know? The government dictates how we spend that money. And they're saying, you know, the no voters saying, now we need an audit on every indigenous organization in Australia. Mate, we get audited every fucking year. Mm. It's what we do. We get audited every year. And, you know, most organizations I know, we come out with an unqualified audit every time. Every time. And if we get a audit that's been, in, that's been shit, then obviously we're going to get shut down. Mm. You know, we get audited. We get audited by our... Because we get, obviously we get money from the, from the government. Mm. And government auditors all the time. Yeah. And it's... It's a... If we don't do the right thing, we're done. We're done. So, how how do you do you feel about the fact that Australia voted down? I mean, it's obvious to me. You're obviously quite. Um, I'm devastated. Stirred up about it. Yeah. I'm, I'm devastated. You know, I I thought this country was mature enough, but obviously it's fucking. Not. I was I was I was so wrong. Just seeing, I was thinking, oh man, this, this is going to be really close. We won't find the results out until next week. Mm. If, Overnight. Yeah. No, 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 no. And I was like, wow. This has now put a stamp, showed the world that this country is so racist. Mm. Mm. What, what, what now? What, what, what can happen now? Yeah. Mark my word. It's going to be a civil war in this community, in, this, in Australia. Mm. Civil, commun- civil, civil war. You know, I, I, I think people, my people now, uh, just like, how I'm going to react to a white man? You know, how I'm going to react? Should I just, I just, you know, I went to work this morning. Everybody said, how are you going? How are you? You know, same shit. It's just a fucking different day. Mm, mm. Say, say the voice got up and, you know, it's, I, I don't mean to be, be, be rude because, because right. obviously the, the voice didn't get up. What would, what would you say to, you know, say you wanted to address education disadvantage in remote communities such as Hope Vale, what would you do to address education? What, 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 sh- know, what, what the, would the voice ideally have said to government? Well, government would be, I don't, I don't know you. It's, it, but... I mean, you couldn't put it in a, in a, in a two minute answer, could you? No, you, you couldn't because, you know, obviously, it's going to take at least a couple of years for the voice to be established first and foremost. Mm-hmm. And you know, we don't know how they're going to look. Yeah. It says in the constitution, Australia should have a high court, high court of Australia. Mm. The mechanism of that, of the high court of Australia, it's not in the constitution, mm. it's just a word. Yeah, yeah. The making up of the court was done by legislation, by, mm-hmm. by politics. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And, but back to your question about education is, we need to have, you know, with our own culture, bring it back our culture within the school. Mm. Have that part of the curriculum. Mm. Have our history part of the curriculum, you know, and and um, bring that opportunity back. Because when they go from here into mainstream school, they're ready for the mainstream school. Mm. When they go at board, they're ready for that. But in the meantime, we're not ready for it. Mm. Our kids are still going from from a year seven and going into a year uh, year going from year six to year seven high school now they're back in year five learning you know it's okay obviously we're, we're limited on, on time but i also want to ask about employment opportunities on the cape what, what what could happen that would that would increase employment for indigenous people in the in the cape you know cooktown hope Val. do you have ideas yeah, obviously well, there's, there's, there are ideas, you know, there is, there's, you know, we, we want to, you know, care for country, all our ranger programs and all our, our, all our protection of animals and all that sort of stuff, that's, that's creating opportunity there, you know. Mm-hmm. Um, 
Oh, yeah, and it's, you know, that sort of stuff, like, um, the, 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 um, land issue is a tight, long, tedious process of getting those land back to our people. You know, so many red tapes. You know, the ones who, who get rich out of are the fucking lawyers, in that sense. Mm. They're the ones who get it, not us. You know, we, we wait, we put in a, a claim, you know, obviously it's 10, 20 years down the track mm. till we get that, you know, get that moving, you know, and, and that, that, those are sort the of opportunities we want to do. We, we want to care for the country, we want to look after the animals, we want to have a future for our children and stuff. Okay, I've just got a couple more questions. What would you say about the, the Aboriginal people who voted no? The, I mean, obviously a small percentage, I think in Hope Vale there was 75% of residents voted yes, so there was obviously a quarter of people who, who voted no. Yeah. Do you understand where they're coming from no. in any way? I think they... White man law. White man law. They, they, they are conspiracy theories. That's, they, 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 um, I don't know, I, I, I have no idea why they voted, voted no. I'd like to ask them why they voted no, but... Um, they don't. They don't give me a definitive answer. None of them does. Mm, mm. They say it's gonna divide us. Fuck, we divided now. We've been divided before the fucking voice. Mm, mm. You know? Do you? Um. Then the last question is: Do you? Do you have any any optimism about Aboriginal progress? Optimism. Optimism. Yes, no, I don't, I don't, I don't really know. At, at this point in time, no. Nah. We are, we are, well, I'm not big for me, I'm devastated for now. Sorry? I'm devastated now. I'm, 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 I'm sad for this time. I'm, but, you know, obviously, you know, we've been here for 65,000 years. We are a resilient bunch, and optimism is going to be there all, all the time. Thank you very much for talking to me. Yeah.